to my channel and today video is going to be sharing about my views and how I complete this eye look with this Innisfree My Palette Eyeshadow I've been waiting this eyeshadow to launch in Malaysia for almost like one month since Innisfree Korea has just launched it one month ago I think I keep on researching their prices on their official website and G Market and so on. This eyeshadow has been overpriced on their official website, I think, due to the currency from USD to Malaysia Ringgit. And luckily, they just launched it one week ago, and I have this with me. Okay, for this eyeshadow, single eyeshadow, for this single eyeshadow, is is uh, twenty four ringgit, which is pretty affordable. Luckily, I didn't buy it on the official website because uh, I have to pay another five ringgit for one single eyeshadow. So I'm going to use this twenty nine shade in matte as my base color. It is pink with purple undertone and not too light. I will use this number 30 in matte also. As you can see, it's a burgundy brown which has red undertone. Have four, and I just accidentally. So be careful when you open this because it's quite tight and you have to be careful. Now I'm going to use this and blend and blend, and blend on my lid. glitter shade in 40 as you can see this is a glitter shade with orange undertone yet pinky and now I'm going to pop it at the center of my lid and testing it out with a brush and as you can see it is not pigmented at all and now I'm using my own finger to pop the color at the center of my lid to see its pigmentation and wow, the result is just nice. And here is it. Ta -da! And the last step, smooth out the line by blending it. For lower lash line, I'm going to use the same color again. Okay, use this base color. Number six. It is a pretty dusty rose shade. Very suitable for daily use and for fall. Using my top brush to roll over the blusher. Then I'm going to apply. And uh, slightly under my eye. Here. Can you see it? Oh, it's so nice. It can give you the effect that is um so natural. Like you brush at your own. Okay, look. So pretty. Oh, 
have this contour in number 3 which is also a matte finish um, I haven't used this before oh, it's not pigmented not pigmented at all but it is suitable for daily use here completes the look okay talking about the packaging the packaging is just so simple uh, and so minimalistic every single eyeshadow and contour and blusher comes with this little acrylic case it is pretty hard to open as it's so tight Why my palette? Okay, this series of my palettes come with these. Uh, there are three sizes, which is the small, and this one's medium, and another is large. The large one could accommodate 18, 18 eye, single eyeshadow, I think. And this one, this one could just accommodate eight single eyeshadow. Okay, this size is just perfect for me. If I want to go traveling, and I just have to pick up three to four single eyeshadows together with one blusher and one contour, and I'm ready to go. Yeah, I just simply take it out and put it. It is magnetic. Here with the magnet also, and I just. Like here, yes. Yeah. That's it. Another great thing about this series of eyeshadow is you can choose whatever the color, the shades that you like, and match it yourself. This is a customized eyeshadow palette, or you can treat it as a blusher palette, contouring palette, uh, as you like. Now I'm going to show you the swatches of these eyeshadows and also the blusher and contour that I bought As you can see that darker shade pick up weaker than a lighter shade. complete the video i hope you guys enjoy it give me a comment if you want to leave a message to me or give me some idea of what you want to watch next and i will try my best give me a thumbs up if you like this video and subscribe to my channel hit the bell so that you can receive the notification whenever i upload a new video and i will see you in the next one bye Yeah, 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 yeah